In a time where pickleball has grown in popularity, Marina High School in Huntington Beach has doubled down on its tennis program. Our Chris Harry recently stopped by the school to learn how their newly renovated courts are bringing money into the program while also providing work opportunities for former students. We're at Marina High School in Huntington Beach. Uh, we're a couple miles from the beach over here. We're very fortunate to have 16 courts. Uh, it's the only high school that I know of that I've been to throughout the country that have 16 courts. The tennis courts at Marina High School were recently renovated and refurbished. And now, not only are they brand new, but the school has also partnered with the Southern California Tennis Association to host tournaments, camps, and other events. Have you seen other high schools try to replicate what Chuck is doing here? And, and how easy is it for a, a tennis program to do this? Yeah, I, I mean, we have what we call the USTA Growth Fund. We have money that we want to go out and resurface courts. Chuck is doing an amazing job, anywhere from free tennis to paid tennis, running tournaments for us. Super awesome uh, partnership with Chuck. Um, you know, we're, we're out there trying to find new courts that we can resurface and, and, and uh, put into play with some revenue share. The renovation of the courts has already provided an incredible return on investment, raising upwards of $10,000 in the past six months, all of which helps support the tennis program. Balls, uh, court maintenance, um, rackets, shoes for kids, something like that. When kids need stringing, coaches don't take anything from that. It all goes straight to our boys and girls high school tennis team, and uh, it's been a great it's been a great situation. It's just really important that people also understand that tennis is booming. Um, there, there's a huge lift in, in, in the tennis world, and we're super excited about it. And some kind we take sometimes take the back seat to that other sport. You hear about pickleball all the time, but here. There's no sign of it. It, it, it. Tell me why it's important to have tennis courts in 2024. Look, it, it, pickleball's great. I, I don't have a, an issue with it. I think it's a great sport. Um, I, I do, it does hurt when uh, they turn a tennis court into pickleball, a pickleball court. That's when I get uh, a little bit riled up. Like tennis just has something special about it. Like pickleball is very fun recreationally, but there's such like a fire to tennis that I don't feel when I play pickleball. You have to like play it and have to be on this team and have to experience this whole atmosphere that just is so different from what I have felt in pickleball so far. The partnership with the USTA also provides opportunities for former student athletes to come back and volunteer with the organization. Our coaches are fantastic. They volunteer their time. Kids are great. We've established such a sense of community here with the, not only the high school kids, but some of the kids from the surrounding community who are willing to help out. I get to just help out wherever I can. I take stores, I put up banners, take down banners. Coach Chuck, he helped me get into becoming a summer associate. He taught me how to like be a better person in a way. Yeah. It's been quite a journey and I still come back. They make jokes about me being a super senior, but <laughs> I still come back.